is up guys and welcome to the second place yes second place uh sword soul tenny uh in the tier zero tier element uh shizu format we have in uh sword soul definitely has its struggles but honestly sword soul especially now it's also a super cool budget meta deck i would even call it because it's super good it still does all the classic combos it has of course rivalry which helps thing plus if you just side well against tears i've noticed lately uh Tears is not really a it's a massive issue still but it's not as big as I initially thought but you know still a really meh format I would say but still I still finally get in play sword soul is pretty much dope but yeah without further ado let's get right into it uh three Ecclesia uh, incredible Ecclesia uh, this card is a lot cheaper uh, of course now uh, with the multiple reprints it's gotten but yeah it's just a staple in sword souls uh you definitely need three of it uh we're gonna go through uh, the sword souls of course uh, of course the let's say Moye uh, Moye is kind of like just the best one of the deck, honestly. Moye is nuts. Uh, gets everything going. Plus, it just helps because it's a water. Uh, uh, put, uh, as you'll see in the extra deck, let's uh, see. Two Long Yang. Uh, and say, and I, I settled on two Source of Lutea because three feels a little too much, but two just honestly, you always have that second one to go into. Uh, so yeah, that is it for uh, the Sword Soul package. Kind of just standard, nothing too crazy. Source Soul packages don't really deviate that much from what I've seen. Uh, but then of course we have the Tenny stuff. Uh, we have three Vashuda. Um, yeah, it's just standard stuff. Three Ashuna, love it. Uh, and then of course the three Adhara. These are the best ones in the deck. We do run of course the one Sithana because we do have all the water extra deck monster that we run. But yeah, standard uh, Tenny lineup, nothing too fancy or crazy with that. So yeah. Uh, for tech cards, I do one. I do. I just ran one mirror mirror out of instinct because it was just part of the Tenny build. So like, I've just a pure Tenny deck for so long, and just having ability to tune around mirror mirror from the deck and just get a bunch of tokens to the board definitely help you synchro climb even faster if you do have the option to come up. Uh, that's why we have it at one because if you can just tune it out, it's fine. But, it, but obviously, we don't want to draw it. Um, spells, uh, emergence. This is your rota. Uh, searches any of your uh, sword souls, then also if you can just if, see if you control a synchro, it just searches any worm, so it's very generic in that sense when it comes to the deck. Uh, we do, uh, this is something I've seen that's debated on, is the Heavenly Dragon Circle. Some builds don't run it, some builds only run one. I like it because it's just an instant, it's a search, it's another search, <laughs> like, it, it just searches anything. Uh, I do also run uh, Flawless Protection because sometimes we just have a monk and we just want something like if we have a field spell that literally is just a maxi for your opponents uh basically if you're just if you just have a monk out so that does come up sometimes i've noticed uh main decking the dark rulers because honestly it's kind of uh insane <laughs> uh, it's it's not as it, it's not really that good anymore but it's still the dark ruler it, uh, it just hits a lot of decks uh, and then of course we have our draw cards uh positive desires obvious and then of course we have foolish too Foolish one of our sword souls to get stuff going. Uh, that's it for the spells. Traps, uh, we of course run the one blackout. I mean, most builds don't opt to play it, but I've opted because uh, blackout's kind of still just good in my general opinion. And then, of course, we have three rivalry. This is your shutdown card. <laughs> that's our because the majority of the cards, besides of Ecclesia, and maybe for the exception of maybe one or two extra deck monsters, it's all worms. So, yeah, and plus. It's it depending on the matchup, it can get sided out as well uh, for side deck stuff. Like Evenly is really good right now. So also shadowing prison, it's a shadow, it's a imprisoning mirror is actually pretty good. So yeah, uh, synchros because uh, of the waters we have one drag eye. It's just a free negate, honestly. If you have it, so why not? <laughs> it stops something. Uh, say so Ruddy Rose Dragon, uh, Berserker of the Tenny. Um, yeah. Uh, this don't have Baron in it, so if you have Baron, definitely run Baron, but I, I never, I, I couldn't get a Baron or I couldn't borrow a Baron, and I don't own a Baron because Barons are expensive. It's all shit and, until they get reprinted, so yeah, if you have Baron, run Baron, but if you don't, you, there's there, there's Roy Rose or all the alternatives. Of course, we have the one Yazi, the one Baxia, uh, crazy. Uh, I ran two of the Grandmaster because Grandmaster, honestly, in testing, I kind of like this too because it just came up. Uh, then of course we have of course the, the one sovereign the one sinister the big boys you make uh yeah they're just good of course the main staple we have three of the monk of the tenny uh yeah uh just gets things going gets stuff in the graveyard and kind of just 
to dart stuff. And then of course we have the two of the shaman, honestly. Shaman's really nice. You gotta be careful though, as it can um, uh, lock you into tennis, so you gotta be careful with the special summon effect. So yeah, I mean, it does come up, but yeah, if you do have a Baron, I'll just cut this down to one and just put a little price to the one Baron. So that is uh, the Sword Soul deck, um, honestly. Loved it. Um, still not vibing with the format that much. That's why I really haven't been going out for locals because, you know, SA tier is kind of just meh. Uh, especially since it's still evolving and still just getting better. But with the OCG ban list that just got released, uh, hopefully tier for the TCG will be coming to an end short, uh, I say quickly than expected. So, yeah, that's cool. But, yeah, this has been a Sword Soul deck profile. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, second place, local stuff. So nothing too crazy. But, yeah, Sword Soul, Teddy is still insanely good. And I would say in this format. Still just one of those rogue good decks. Those rogue, I say borderline meta decks. So, yeah. And it's cheap, so pick it up if you ever want to play it. But yeah, I so said thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment, and subscribe like always. And until the next video, stay safe and stay healthy. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.